Hi, I'm David Berlin with ZDNet, and this is a technology shakedown. It's a new series we're coming up with on ZDNet where we catch technology completely breaking down on us on video. Now behind me here is my wife's brand new Lenovo ThinkPad that I purchased for her. It's running Windows Vista and I had to uninstall the Symantec crapware that was on here. That's the software that comes preloaded on the system but I have to actually pay extra money to make it work. And I reinstalled McAfee's antivirus software which comes free from my ISP. That happens to be Comcast. Now I put McAfee's software on here and in about a few seconds what you're going to see happen on the screen is a big splash and a big McAfee is going to come up. This happens every four minutes and ten seconds. Here it comes and every time that happens it adds a new M to this tray down here. There's an M, there's three M's here right now and to make them go away if I want to I just mouse over them like this and sometimes I have to click on them and after I click on them they'll disappear and there it goes away one and I have to click on another one, that one will probably go away too. Now if I let it go far enough, the M's will fill up the entire tray at the bottom here. They'll take over the whole tray and you'll miss the other icons that belong there. That's one thing that drives me nuts. Another thing that drives me nuts is why is it doing this in the first place? Why does it keep splashing this McAfee thing up? It takes system resources, it has to think about it because you see the mouse pointer spin and then it throws these M's up on the screen. Now I'm working with McAfee to figure this out, but it's definitely technology failing and there's really not much on the system. A few pieces of software, a brand new installation of Vista, brand new computer, brand new McAfee, and for some reason it's not working. Now if you have a video of a technology breakdown happening at your house or at your business, feel free to send it to us and we'll post it in our series, Technology Shakedown. For ZDNet, I'm David Berlin.